The displacements of over 2 million people across areas ravaged by insurgency led to the setting up of camps at safe locations by governments to give succor to the distressed. However, access to camps outside Meduguri, the state capital, such as those in Burma, Banki, and Bikwa, among others, remains a challenge as military escort is required to travel to such remote locations. This scenario puts thousands who have been in captivity for close to six years at risk, having suffered deprivation for long. When I went to the camp, I saw the kids that are lacking in so many things. So the children in a, in a pathetic condition, they need attention. Uh, I interviewed one of the health personnel who told me they have more than 30,000 IDPs there. Things like food, medication, water, eh? and so on and so forth. These are the challenges. The level of distraction is beyond the state government and sometimes even beyond the, the, the federal government considering the economic situation in the country. The Bruno State Government, in collaboration with international partners, recently evacuated about 2,000 Malorish infants, children and adults from Burma for special Medicare and Medigree. Most of them were among the newcomers to the camps after being rescued by troops. Here you have a particular plan for an X number of people and it turns out that the number increases or even multiplies, you tend to have you know, food shortage. And that is why what the state government is doing is to continue, continuously track the number of IDP.